Well, we use a lot of zippers on our products, specifically the wind seeds. Right? Yeah. So we try really hard to have the best quality of everything, including zippers. So we use a brand called YKK. Which are the best zippers we've been able to find by far. They're the most robust and durable um, and functional. And the YKK 10C, which means 10 gauge coil zips that we use for the main body portions of the wingsuit, have a locking mechanism in the slider. And that locking mechanism prevents the zipper slider from traveling on the zipper without you actually grabbing that slider tab and pulling on it. So a locking slider means that it shouldn't move unless you want it to by actually pulling on the slider. Right, so inside the zipper there's a little metal tab that actively locks and keeps it from sliding the opposite way. When you're, when you're closing the zipper, that tab is a ratchet, so it lifts out of the way as you're closing. You don't have to do anything. But when you're unzipping, you have to actively pull that lock out of the way to unzip. And the way you do that is by pulling on the metal tab that activates or deactivates the lock and allows you to unzip. Yeah, and so unfortunately, even the best companies in the world sometimes have uh, variations in manufacturing quality. And what we've seen since 2021 is a higher incidence of defective sliders coming from YKK. And we're in contact with YKK about this issue. We've been talking to them and they're very, really good about our feedback and they're interested in the issue but we've just seen some inconsistencies with some of these sliders. And as a result of that, we've had some sliders move on their own without input, which is super annoying. And if this has happened to you on your squirrel suit, we're sorry, we know it sucks. It's super annoying for us as well, and we definitely don't like it, and we're doing everything we can to fix it. In the meantime, we've got a couple of solutions. There's kind of two pools of solutions. One would be you could modify your zipper slider with a little rubber band that keeps that lock more actively engaged. It's a little bit hackish, but it works pretty well for most people. That's a quick, easy fix that yeah. takes just a few minutes to implement if you're having this issue and you want a short-term solution. Yeah, we got There's a, a video for that. Yeah, quick how-to on how to do that yourself. You just need a rubber band and some scissors and some patience. A lot of patience. A lot of patience. The other more effective solution is to clip off the metal tab that you normally use to pull the zipper and replace it with a piece of spectra that is a soft engagement. So you actively have to put more force into it to unlock and pull the slider. Yeah, the softer, lighter spectra essentially is gentler on that locking device and allows the slider locking mechanism to work better. So even on the defective or the less optimal sliders that we've gotten from YKK, the soft spectra lanyard solves the issue and you don't have any more movement, any more unintentional movement. It's basically a sure fix. And uh, we can ship you these lanyards at any moment. Just shoot us an email if you're having the issue. We'll send you the lanyards and a little video link so you can see how to do it. It just takes a few minutes to replace them.